Well, good morning, YouTube. How are all of you doing? Welcome to yet another vlog on the Maria Heidel's channel. Whoop, whoop! believe Maria has time to make vlogs on YouTube absolutely so before we get started on the vlog I'm gonna tell you guys what the vlog is gonna look like okay guys so here's how the routine is gonna work for today I'm actually some parts of the video obviously I'm not gonna show I'm like gonna brush my teeth and stuff like that I will show you guys fixing my bed fixing breakfast and stuff like that so we're just gonna do that um, for those of you that aren't familiar, I'll show you my iPhone XR right now. I did order yet another case from Amazon. And for those of you that aren't aware, I'm pretty sure I didn't announce this on YouTube, but it's probably going to disappoint some of you guys. But, uh, well, let me open the hall light so you guys can see me better. I hope you can see me better now. Um, so basically the cases that you guys have, I don't know if you, yeah, I think you guys have seen it. It's another video that got lots of views, guys. It's about the heyday cases, you know, the pink one. Um, the Otterbox Defender case, those cases, I no longer have. And you guys may think, did you sell it? No, guys. I got it from Target, and they have a 90-day return policy. And so, basically, I was able to actually return it back to them. And only reason is because I just wasn't happy. I put the cases on my phone, and I just wasn't happy. And I don't want to hold on to cases that I'm never going to use. So I decided to actually get my money back. So I found this really adorable one on Amazon, and it was only eight bucks guys it was extremely cheap and so i'm really really excited to see what it looks like on the iphone 10r again guys you know the otter box was just boring black i mean it was great protection and everything but it was like so boring um the heyday case the gray one if you guys recall the protection on that is i don't want to swear i don't want to i don't want you guys to hear my french um so yeah, the, the gray heyday case was terrible. The pink one was okay, but I feel like it was too bright for me. I don't know. I wasn't a huge fan of it. I mean, I like the color pink, but I'm like, you know, I think I'm going to return that. So, you know, basically I returned them and I no longer have them, but we will uh, get the uh, Amazon case today and first look at the iPhone XR. I will show you guys use like on my iPhone XR what it looks like because obviously it hasn't arrived yet it's supposed to come today but i don't know like the exact time frame but like i said i have the amazon app and it notifies me and stuff like that so with that being said we're gonna do that also i know you guys don't know but i'm also supposed to see my counselor guys the landline's ringing hold up all right guys i'm very sorry it was the landline phone and some unknown guy was calling uh, but anyways, yeah, so I'm going to go to my counselor today at my school, and I did make an appointment to actually see her for my classes, guys, because, yeah, I'm a computer science major. So I'm going to go to her. My appointment time's at 1 o'clock. So we're going to go do that, and I'm definitely going to register for classes uh, and stuff like that. So I'm not sure, like, how many classes I'm going to take. Definitely you guys will find out in this video. Um, so we're going to go do that. I was going to go to the gym today, but uh, check this out. Guys, I want you to check this out. Right now, it says in Chicago, it is currently 83 degrees in Fahrenheit. But then, if you scroll down on your, if you guys have iPhones, of course, it says it feels like 91, okay? And it's expected to get warmer later. So, basically, guys, I am actually not, and I repeat, I am not going to go to the gym today because of the really high humidity we have. The temperature is climbing. The air conditioning has been working literally since this morning. So it's been extremely crazy, guys. So, uh, yeah. Yeah, guys. So we're definitely not going to go to the gym today. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to vlog this morning. I'm going to vlog the Amazon case and I'm going to vlog the school. And I think we're going to end the video there for you guys because pretty much the rest of the afternoon, I'm probably going to be lazy. I might vlog a little bit of lunch as well. So again, this is basically what the video is going to be looking like. So it's kind of like a day in the life kind of video. I kind of like making those so you guys can see how I run a typical day. And no, guys, I'm not working today. So that's the only reason the camera is out. I actually have a day off, believe it or not. So anyways i'm gonna start right now we're gonna actually we're gonna fix the bed right now i'm at when i do change guys and get ready for the day obviously that's not gonna be in the video but uh we're gonna get uh, a time lapse right now of me fixing the bed so hope you guys enjoy
All right, guys, so sorry if this time-lapse video didn't turn out like you guys were hoping. Again, guys, if you're wondering, yes, my tripod is broken, so I, I just hope that you guys got a good shot. Um, if not, I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, I just want to show you guys, I did get new pillows from Amazon.com, and for those of you that are interested, then I definitely will show you. So, first of all, it's the only reason the part has been cut. So... I'm just going to show you guys how I usually, because I've got tons of pillows, and I know you guys may think I'm literally crazy. Um, so, usually these main pillows that I sleep with, I usually would like to put them under here, okay? Um, I do sleep with extra heavy sheets because I'm kind of weird, but uh, yeah, I put this like this. That's just the main pillow, and yeah, I did change bedspreads. If you, I have made a lot of YouTube videos in this room, Um yeah, so I do apologize for the mess on the floor. I'm actually going to clean that next, believe it or not. I have, like, my gym stuff on the floor and, you know, stuff from my job yesterday. So, but anyways, yep, I did change bedspreads. I've had it for years. I just didn't feel like using it, but, yep. And I'll show you guys my new emoji pillows that I got because I thought they were cute. Yeah, it is quite messy in here, guys. I'm really sorry. Like I said, I came from work pretty late yesterday, and I am exhausted. Because I, okay, so basically, yeah, the main pillows guys go there. So I like to take these big pillows. At nighttime, I do sleep with these back there because, as you guys can tell, there is a mirror. And I, for some reason, I don't like mirrors. But usually during the day, I take the pillow and I literally just put it like that. And I'll show you guys the other one. Just so you guys can see how I kind of fix my bed in the morning. So then we take this one and we just put it there literally okay so the finished product looks like that and then i'll just show you guys my new emoji pillows these i got from amazon all three of them 22 bucks so not too expensive i got this cute one i think he's really adorable so i was thinking about just putting them like this next to each other so there's that one i got this emoji pillow that has hearts super cute i'm just gonna literally just put them in the middle or oh by the way third one <laughs> I mean, this guy's really just just having fun. And also, I have this pillow, guys. I have this one. This pillow I usually use when I just want to do laptop time or something. What I may do is just like, hold on, guys. All right, guys. And here is the finished product of the bed. I'm going to move the camera. So, I put... So, these three mochi pillows are, like, so nice, guys. I'm in love with them. And, you know, like I said, it does match my bedspread. You know, I kind of really in the past wanted emoji pillows in my room. Uh, so I'm just really glad that Amazon had them because I would literally go to Target. I would go to Walmart and literally nobody would have them. So it's kind of disappointing. But again, Amazon had it and actually Amazon delivered it just on time. Okay, but they're super quick. And so I really like Amazon a lot for these pillows. And I think they literally match perfectly, guys. I'm very happy with the product. Uh, Amazon, if they ask me to review, of course I'm going to give them good ratings. Um, yeah. If you guys are wondering where I got that big gray pillow, I got it from Bed Bath & Beyond. I forgot how much it is because I've had it for a while. But it's really comfortable and I really like it. And then, yeah, that's literally my bed, guys. So I hope you did enjoy the bed part. And again, if you didn't see me too well, I'm sorry. It's only because, yeah, I don't, my tripod broke. So the next thing I'm going to do, um, I'm actually going to do it off camera. I'm going to kind of, you know, clean up this room a little bit. I have my work uniform over there. I have some shoes that don't need to be out. So I'm just going to kind of clean up. Uh, I got to get rid of that reusable bag. Got to get rid of that that other bag over there. So I'm going to go ahead and clean up and then once I'm done, the camera will roll again. So I will see you guys in a bit. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I have tried to clean up this area a little bit in my room. So everything does look pretty spick and span as of now. Oh, by the way, guys, I just, I forgot to show you this too. I'm kind of an idiot. You know, that's how busy I am. I don't have time to show you guys. So guys, I am one of probably one of the laziest people that you guys will ever meet, okay? So this, believe it or not, I like to sometimes keep my laptop on there. And, you know, like I do have a little before school studying that I have to do. And later on in this video, I might explain to you guys what that is. Because this is something my counselor told me to do over the summer. Uh, so yeah, but anyways, let me just show you guys this. I got this thing from Target and you guys would never guess how much I paid for this. Five 
box in the dollar section. Believe me, if you do not believe me, pause this video, pause your phone, whatever you're watching this out of, go run to the Target dollar spot. You will find it right there. Because I know, like, when I first found out this was five bucks, I didn't believe it personally. But then it is five bucks, and I'm like, okay, that is crazy. I'm getting it. And so it's it's really nice, guys. I love this thing. And, you know, literally I can work from my bed because, yeah, I do have a desk over there. But sometimes it's just like, you know, I have one quick thing to do. I'm just going to work out of this. And whenever I do my video editing, I will use this only because my MacBook, when it uploads to YouTube, it gets really hot. And I don't like to have it on fabric. So on this thing, it's much more safer because my Mac gets hot. So... I am super excited to say that I finally own one of these and like I said it's only five bucks so if you guys like to work from your bed like me definitely go check it out all right guys welcome back to the next part so I decided I'm going to show you guys the uh, uh, me brushing my teeth and combing my hair uh, so again it's probably going to be a time lapse once again so I'm taking you guys to my bathroom right now and I I'm just going to put it towards one part of the bathroom so hope you guys enjoy So there you go, teeth all cleaned. Now we're about to go head down and eat some breakfast, guys. Uh, so again, hope you're enjoying the time lapses. First time trying these on YouTube, so hope you guys are enjoying it. So I'll take you guys to my kitchen right now, and we're actually gonna go eat some breakfast. But before I do that, I need to grab my iPhone XR. Um, only reason is because if Amazon does drop me a text message, before I go to my counselor. What we're gonna eat for breakfast, this is our freezer. I'm thinking about making some lovely waffles today. Ooh, I haven't had those in quite some time. Gonna make the best, we're gonna make waffles, why not? I haven't had them in like, I don't know, a couple of weeks. Only because of work, guys, been so busy. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to plug the toaster in, for God's sakes. Okay. And yes, I do make coffee Keurig. I almost cut myself from that toaster. Wow. Because I tried to grab it underneath and it was just like, whoa. Alright. I'm going to stick this guy right in. And I usually hit the freezer button because it's frozen, obviously. I usually eat one waffle in the morning, guys. Um, only because... Yeah, I, I'm not really a big crazy fan, so we're definitely going to add waffles to the breakfast menu, but also some bacon. I think that there might be some downstairs. I just bought it. Hold on, guys. Let me make sure that there's no bacon in my refrigerator, so hang on. There's not. All right, guys, we're going to have to run downstairs and see if there's any bacon, because I love bacon. Guys, come with me. For the new subscribers who haven't seen my house, maybe I'll give you guys like a house tour kind of video someday when I have time. Yep, and we do have another refrigerator full of pop down here. Uh, oh, perfect. Yes, we do have a bacon right here. Lucky day, guys. Lucky day. Unexpectedly, the phone case is coming, so that's how lucky I am today. That'd be funny if something lucky came in the mail for me today. That would be awesome. Alright, so this is one of those, if you guys haven't heard of this, I'll explain real quick. It's one of those bacons that you just put in the microwave that can be made in about a minute. But, we have a weird electrical system in here. Like, if this toaster for some reason is running and the microwave is running, the fuse will go out. So, that's the only reason why I can't set it up yet. So I'm going to get this thing open. I'm filming with one hand, so I do apologize in advance. So 
Sorry, I was making sure my iPhone was here. All right, so this guy can be thrown in over here. It's kind of a stupid idea, but hey, I'm lazy. Recycles, they go right in here. All right, and then, because I will need both hands. Turn off the hall light right there because there's too much lights running. So, oh my god, open bag, open bag. Okay, so the bacon has been officially opened, it does come in a convenient bag. Grab a plate. That scared the shit out of me in there and quit scaring people that was the waffle by the way but when it comes out of that cycle it's actually not ready believe it or not so i'm like okay so you need i usually put one of these paper towels on the bottom of the bacon because i just find it a little bit easier so the grease can just go i usually have about two or three strips of bacon and so since today's gonna be a lazy day i'm gonna have three strips of bacon so but i'm technically guys i'm trying to lose some but this is actually one of those bacons that don't have a lot of calories. I believe it said like three strips or something, 70 or 75 calories, something like that. All right, guys. So again, we do have to wait for that um, toaster to be done. And I'm also going to make a Starbucks coffee from the Keurig. I'm not actually going to Starbucks. It's too hot and stuff like that so uh yeah that's literally it i'm actually gonna cut here and when we're getting ready to make the keurig i'll film again so that's it for now bye guys all right guys we are back it looks like the waffle is actually finally ready hold on hold on guys because hold on okay i do apologize in advance we're just gonna grab a plate another plate yes put it right here there's our waffle so pardon the mess in the kitchen again, folks. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and unplug the toaster. And we're going to pop in the bacon, believe it or not. I'm going to make that and then the Keurig will be done last. I'll open some light because my camera really doesn't do well when there's no light. So it needs light in here. All right, here we go. So you put it in for a minute, for those of you that don't know. And you just literally wait a minute. You'll see what's going to happen in a minute. They'll get cooked. Almost done, guys. All right. It smells in here. I know you guys can't smell it, but it does smell in here. Ooh, this looks yummy in the tummy. Oh, my God, guys. Ooh. I think I over may have overcooked it because this bacon wasn't that greasy. So I'll just wipe off the grease for y'all on YouTube so you can see how. Yeah, it is slightly overcooked, darn it. But that's okay. I like crispy bacon, believe it or not. It's really yummy. And later for lunch, I might get that on segment. I have some French bread pizza that I got. Uh, Red Baron, I'll show you guys. I think I'm going to get that on video, but I'm not 100% sure yet. I haven't made that decision. Depends on how long the vlog is. Right now, it's looking pretty long. So we'll see. But there's that. Now I'm going to go ahead and put in the Keurig for you guys. i push that toaster right back because we don't want it in the way. Okay, make sure there's nothing in there because sometimes I leave it in there like an idiot. Uh, Alright, so here we go. This is my all-time favorite. Yum. And I get them from Target, believe it or not, because they come in like a 16-pack. Versus like, if you go to like to the store Woodman, if you guys are familiar with it, it comes in like 
uh, a seven pack, so. Or actually, ten pack, I'm sorry. Anyways, I'll let you guys enjoy the Keurig moment. And while I'm eating breakfast, guys, I'm not gonna get that on video because I gotta focus on eating. But uh, as soon as that is made, I'll go ahead and set it up for you guys. And uh, yeah, I believe that I that the coffee creamer I might have enough to be able to make this coffee later. So yeah. Wow, you were very squeaky today, machine. Sorry guys, it is kind of a slow machine. Alright guys, it's officially ready, so here we go. So you take this guy and you insert him right here. And then y'all press the button. I'm gonna have medium size. And we'll just quietly watch it dispense. Ooh, that didn't sound normal. Did you guys hear that? I guess it's working. That's kind of weird. It didn't suck a lot of water. But whatever. As long as I get a decent amount of coffee. What the heck? Guys, oh, okay. I'm like, what's wrong with this machine? Guys, if any of you are, like, Keurig, uh, Keurig people and you know, why does this machine once in a while give us problems? I mean, we cleaned it out. We did everything we could, but sometimes we encounter problems. But this time it works fine, which is good. Yeah, if any of you know, leave any comments in the comments section. Because I've had problems before and I don't want to get a new Keurig. So let me know if there's a solution to that. Anybody who knows. Alright, and then we're done. So I'm going to power it off. I'm going to throw this right in the garbage. Alright, and then close this guy up. And then I'm going to set up my coffee. So I'm going to go ahead and eat breakfast. We're going to get the mail and Amazon later. So hope you enjoyed this part. See you later. All right, guys. This is a quick update. I just finished eating breakfast as of right now. I'm just going to wash a few of the dishes. I'm going to clean those lunch boxes. Phone update. I did not get anything from Amazon. So obviously it hasn't been delivered, guys. But yeah, I'll keep you guys posted on how Amazon goes. I'm literally just going to wash a few dishes. Maybe I'll swish some fluoride in my mouth because I usually put fluoride on right after I eat to prevent cavities and stuff like that. And then I might just like relax for a little bit because I don't have to be at the counter until like 1. So I'll probably leave the house like around like 12, I don't know, like 12, 15 or something. So the current time is almost 11. So anyways, I'll keep you guys updated. If I get anything, I'll let you guys know. That's it for now. Bye, guys. Hi everybody, it is Maria Heidos. The current time right now in Chicago is about 12 o'clock. I'm going to start to get ready to go my counselor. I was working on a little before school work right now. Um, I just got a notification on my iPhone and I'll verify with you guys. And there it is. The package has been delivered and yeah, I got a picture of my house. But uh, anyways guys, the package has been delivered and we're going to undo it right here on camera with you guys. And I'm really, really psyched about this. So we're gonna do the, we're gonna put the case on before we go and then I'm gonna get ready to go to my school, guys. So let's do it. Let's go open that door and see the case. 
Oh my god, I've been waiting like all morning, and I probably should explain to you guys what before school work is. There it is. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's hot out here, guys. You have no idea. See, this is why I'm saying I really should stay away from the heat. I'm not even going to the gym today. Here it is. Lock the door. Here we are in our house. Here it is. Woo! It's here. I'm so psyched. You know, I'm really, really nervous, too, because I've never actually gotten an iPhone XR case. All right, here it is. Oh, my God. Because I got a notification on my phone a few minutes ago that the thing is nine stops away, and I'm like, oh, great. <laughs> so it's here. Um, I'm really excited and nervous. So... All right, guys, so what we're going to do is we're going to try it on my phone. I did read some customer reviews on Amazon saying that there's a surprise with that phone case, and I don't know what the surprise is, okay? Um, they said it came with a little surprise, so, yeah, I'm really nervous about that. Um, so, yeah. Uh, so, let's get started here. As soon as I'm done, we're actually going to get ready. I'm super nervous. I should probably prop the camera right here, and I'm hoping that you guys can see. Okay. Here we go. Like I said, it was only eight bucks on Amazon.com. So, oh my God, I can see it through the light. I'm gonna cut it open. Oh my God. There's nothing else in the envelope. And yes, I gotta throw my address away. Oh my God, how cute. Can you guys see it? Oh my God, it's so cute. Oh my God. Okay, I need to, like, stop. I, this is going to be my main phone case, so I'm going to cut it open with my scissors. <gasps> oh, my God, how cute. Oh, my God. And, oh, my God, it comes with a freaking pop socket. Oh, yay, guys. Pop socket. Oh, my God. Guys, I want to use the pop socket, but, I, and oh, my God, it matches it. Oh, my God. Guys, it's so cute. But, actually, I'm going to save the pop socket because I may use it another time. Um, because I do like to wireless charge my phone and I know pop sockets can sometimes interfere But we're gonna keep it in this little bag is someday if I decide to use it I will put it on but I love pop sockets. Oh my god. That's what the surprise was. Oh my god guys Look at this beautiful case. Oh my god It's so cute and it's so protective in comparison to the stupid flimsy cheap one from five below. Oh my god guys Look at this. Oh my god Oh my god, it's so cute and sparkly. Oh my god, I can't wait to put it on the iPhone. We're gonna do it on camera for y'all on YouTube, so let's do it. <sighs> Goodbye, Five Below Cheap $5 case from Five Below. I'll never miss you again in my life. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm totally kidding, guys. Don't think that way. Oh my god. I'm so nervous because, like, my phone's like, why are you putting me in this? <gasps> Okay, I need to stop. I know you guys on YouTube are like, seriously, Maria, you are one crazy psycho. And why am I... Oh, my God. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, my God. Look at it, guys. Look at it. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I love it. <laughs> it's so cute. Yeah, guys, lately I've been into such cute cases. And I know you guys are ready to, like, say, like, say, scream at your computer or phone. Maria, why are you going crazy? I love this phone case. Oh, my God. Look at it. It's so cute. And I didn't think it was going to look good with a red, but it does. And oh my God, I love the sparkle so much. Oh, I love it. Guys, I love this thing. And again, it was only eight bucks on Amazon. It wasn't even, look at the sides here. They're so sparkly. Look at this, guys. It's so cute. Oh my god because when it comes to sparkles i love sparkles and it came with a bonus pop socket which i am really happy about because i love pop sockets but and it does match perfectly with it but like i said i do like to wireless charge my phone so and like i said sometimes these things could possibly interfere so i'm not going to put it on but i love it it's got excellent protection guys and it shows my apple logo versus this one that never showed anything so I am super excited. I'm going to see if I can, how I text with it. I might, I might just text one of my friends right now just for a test. Hopefully they're not going to be mad. Hey, I, oh wow, the silent button's off. There we go. Got my new phone case on Amazon. Oh my God. I'm so excited, guys. This case is adorable. 
I just texted my friend and I felt super comfortable. Like I said, guys, if you're looking at cute phone cases, I would definitely recommend Amazon. They have a large selection of cases there. And like I said, if you get this one, um, it does come with a pop socket, which makes me super excited. And yeah, oh my god. And I feel like with these cute sparkles here, like I have a better grip to my phone or something. It's just so cute. Oh my god. And I like to kind of play around with it and just shake it a little bit. Oh my god. Oh, he's so cute. Okay. So, anyways, guys, I do apologize in advance again. Here's my phone. Here's maybe a better shot of it. There it is again. Can you guys see? Woo! Oh my god, this is really exciting, guys. I'm so excited. It actually came in right before I had to go to the counselor, so I'm actually really happy about that because now I can go there and just not wanting to be rushed to come home because I'm like, oh my god, I gotta get my phone case. So... I hope you did enjoy this part. So I've made the decision to just vlog going to my school and registering. And that's probably going to end the vlog because I don't want to make it too long. I know that some of you guys do not like long vlogs. So we're just going to vlog the school, the time lapse driving to the school and uh, possibly coming home. And then, yeah, the rest of the day, I'm just to relax. So I'm just really happy my case came in. I'm already like falling in love with it. It's so cute. And, you know, and it actually makes it look really nice with the red. I mean, the red doesn't show too much of it, but I'm not going to worry because it's cute, you know. So, again, 8 bucks on Amazon, guys. You know, I'm extremely excited. And, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this part. I will see you guys when I'm getting ready to go see my counselor. Peace out. <music>
Hello everybody, it is Maria Heidos, and as I'm doing my editing, I realized that not all the parts for my camera got imported. So if you guys are wondering why do I look like this, I literally am editing the video and getting ready to post it on YouTube. And I totally lost the outro, so I'm kind of making it using my MacBook FaceTime camera. So I'm going to go ahead and make the outro right now. So, um... Overall, the video so far is coming out well. I had to cut out some parts, guys, just because it's a 40-minute video. So I'm sorry for the vlog being extremely long. I had a good day overall, just relaxing now and just, you know, just enjoying being in the nice, cool house rather than outside, which I believe is still pretty darn hot. Um, believe it or not, it says it feels like 99 degrees, so it is extremely hot. Unhealthy air quality for sensitive groups. That's my phone says. But anyways, with that being said, guys, I want to thank you so much for hanging out with me. I really, really love making vlogs, and I want to make more vlogs. So the next vlog that I'm going to make is a back-to-school haul video. I got to go get some stuff from Walmart. Like, I saw some school supplies from Walmart that I'm going to buy, as well as textbooks. And the day that I buy textbooks, guys, I might consider going back to Wabonzi and vlogging it for you guys on YouTube, so I'll make sure that I charge the camera. So we are to have back to school vlogs are gonna come soon, so if you're a back to school fan, definitely stay tuned for that. And um, yeah, that's about it guys. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you enjoyed this video, please do me a huge favor, and please smash that thumbs up button. It would really mean a lot to me if you did, and I will see all of you in my next one. Peace out. <music>